revitalised in this area. But the reality is that we've been so successful that you're going to see with the population projections for the CBD, large numbers of people doubling of the population here, and the roads just won't fix it. And we can't put any more buses than we already are putting on the roads, so something has to give. Um, I'd like to, to really applaud each of the political parties. I'd like to applaud Ken Bagley. He has done an outstanding job as the chair uh, in this term of the city council for leading the CNR team to accept that this is a project that is long overdue. So thank you for the advocacy on that. Thank you for the advocacy from the regional council and the to convey to them my very, very best wishes. And can I say that John Banks really gets a great big tick from me from turning the corner and saying, yes, rail's the, the future. And, and I bring with me today his very best wishes, the, the points that David has made. This is not about left, this is not about right. And, and let me tell you, from my years in Parliament, the National Party and the Labour Party would be both as bad as each other in advancing this particular issue. But we won't bear that anymore as Aucklanders. We just want to move the thing ahead. Um, it's great that the Manukau link is, is future-proof for rail. Um, but as you say, we can't actually do any link to the airport unless we actually get this right. 